Hello everyone, welcome back. Mom here. Kimmy here. Storm here. <laughs> We're excited to be watching Luca today. All three of us are blind. Excellent. New yeah. movie. Disney Plus. Mm -hmm. yeah, yes. Yes, a new movie, 2021. And we know nothing about it. It is a Pixar and Disney creation. I saw a couple Very brief good. trailers. It looks like it takes place in Italy. And oh, there's nice. fish creatures. And that's all I know, because I don't know if you guys saw any trailers for it. Did you? I did not. Yeah, no, no, nothing, right? So no, I won't say no. anything else because I saw something else in the trailer, but I think it'll be a fun surprise to see first viewing. Excellent. <laughs> yeah, I've yes. never seen anything. Mm -hmm. That's great. Yeah, so as most of you know, we do have a Patreon. So if you want to check out our links below, we have a huge library of videos, movies, shows, a ton of things for you guys to check out. Mm -hmm. And videos come out a week or more early on our Patreon before they hit YouTube. We love our full reactions. That's full on, just mm -hmm. Patreon. But any help you can give us there really helps us create more stuff. And we love Disney, so shall we get into Luca? Yes. Yes, let's do it. Love to see it. Let's do it. Mom's gonna kill me. Uh. <laughs> like sheep. <laughs> Ma'am, have you? Yes. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Oh, Still works. <laughs> Hmm. These little treasures. Mm. Oh yeah, thanks. What? What are you doing? Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh, pulls him up. No way. Oh. No, no, no. That would be amazing. Or <laughs> in the water. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Did you really go up to the? It scared me. <laughs> 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 it's a good defense too. It's like, oh god. Piacere, Trollamo Trombetta. What does it mean? Come on, I'll show you some more stuff. She doesn't even know. Vespa is freedom. Oh, watch your hand. Oh crap, oh, what's going on? Oh my god. Oh, you just said, oh. Whoa. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no! Oh god! Oh, oh, oh god! <laughs> oh, wow, okay. Nice. And who's holding the ramp? The turtle. Come on, it's faster than oh, it looks. No. Okay, oh, here we go. Oh, uh, separated. Oh my. Hold on tight. Whoa, that poor turtle underneath. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. I heard of him. <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> I ain't gonna touch the moon. And every night we'll sleep under the fish. No one to tell us what to do. Just you and me out there. He's so lonely. He must have lost his family or something. Yeah. All new food, sights, everything. Smells. What's wrong with you, stupid <gasps> ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> Some ice cream. Are you chasing him with a sandwich? Yeah. <gasps> uh -oh, oh no! <laughs> oh god! Just a little bit. No, 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 no! Oh, it's oh, gonna no. change. Oh, you're going to change this, right? We underdogs have to look out for each other, right? What's under the dogs? Underdogs. <laughs> you know, the dogs. people who are different, dressed weird. When you race in a cup, what do you get? So is me, prize money. But it could get you that. <laughs> <That's close. laughs> yeah. Let's see what you got. <laughs> no, <I'm serious. laughs> How much? Oh, the ladies, oh no! Right to the ladies. Oh. Okay, good. Oh, don't fall don't in. in the water. It's splashed. Oh, oh yeah. <gasps> oh no! Oh, my God. Oh, shit. 
<laughs> a cat knows too much. <laughs> Yum. Yeah. He doesn't know how to eat. <laughs> no, he doesn't. He doesn't know how to use the fork. <laughs> There's gonna be land monsters everywhere. Monster, it's me! See they are all wet. The sky's been leaking. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, my fishing. God, I look right above the water. The cat too. Oh, a poor cat. Okay. <laughs> Troops. Time for us to go home. Oh no no! My gosh. He's gonna cry. Who wants his ice cream cone? Oh. No control. Oh. We're seeing fish. It's awesome. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. oh no! And get it. It's not nice. But she's good with the ball. Oh, oh she is, isn't she? Yeah, she is. I'm good. <laughs> the dolphin. <laughs> the dolphin. Uh oh. You know those aren't fish, right? Of course they are. Come with me. At least she's very like understanding with the whole thing too. You know, yeah, she doesn't make fun of them and go like, "What's wrong with you?" <laughs> 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 Come on, let's go. Could I maybe oh, borrow this? You can oh, she's it. giving it to him. Aww. Aww. We don't need school. We don't need anybody. Couldn't we just Dude. try it? Luca, see what happens to him? Can't go to school. Mm -hmm. What do you think is going to happen when they see your fish face? Yeah, <laughs> 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 oh. oh. He was so quick to react. That's so scary. Oh, <gasps> uh -huh. Zing! Whoa! <laughs> I'm not afraid. You're the one who gets afraid. Shut up! Ooh. Oh, no, no. See, he gets him more than Luca needs him. Don't scare oh, her. Oh, it's scary now. See? I knew this would happen. monster! <gasps> oh, no. He even uh -oh. said that, too. Oh, no, no. Oh. Oh. Ah, he uses oh. his yeah. oh. Do you know where he went? Uh, no, oh, he's going but for him. I don't think he wants anyone looking for him. Not just in case. Oh, oh how sweet. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Still okay. Oh, God. No, oh. don't say I was just Oh, gonna... shoot. What are those marks on the wall? For how long it's been since his parents passed Tell or something? Since need. his father's been gone. He's better off without me. You are too. That's not true. No. Yes, it is. Not like He's gonna sink. <sighs> He's gonna sink with that. He can't even swim <sighs> as a human. He hasn't tried. Oh, he's oh, rotten. Rotten. oh, he tripped him. Uh oh, oh rain, oh, oh no. no. Oh goodness. No, no. Oh my boy, you're such a no, 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 no. Uh oh. No. <gasps> Everyone's gonna, gonna see. see him. You two don't belong here. Get out of my town. Oh. Oh. Everyone's gonna see so oh, him. No. No. <laughs> no, don't be scary, don't be scary. Oh boy. <laughs> really? You just thought they were humans oh for a second. Like, <laughs> kind of make a connection. They're intelligent. <gasps> oh no. Uh, they're not monsters. Oh yeah? Who are they then? You're the monster. <laughs> Punch them. <laughs> Good. Good. Oops. Good. Oh, big and I'm so proud of you, and I am so mad at you. <laughs> 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 Mustache. <gasps> oh, 
<laughs> See, so many were in hiding. So many more. Oh, Mom, what are you doing here? I come to town <laughs> most weekends. <laughs> Sweater, if it gets cold. For the millionth time, Z. Oh, I love her love dad. Too, <laughs> oh, that's so good. Well, let's go fix up our Vespa. It's a crazy thing. I might have sold it. <gasps> oh, to give him a ticket. Luca, look oh. me in the eye. Oh. You know I love you, right? I know. Oh. <laughs> I can't do it without you. You can't. But you're never without me. Ah. Uh, Trombetta. What does that mean? No idea. <laughs> Go find out for me, will you? Yeah, you guys want to make sure you're <laughs> saying right. the right thing. Yeah. No more stupido. <laughs> Look forward. That's right. Yeah. That was good. <laughs> That, was, that was really good. <laughs> that was a great story. Good. <laughs> so we'll let it run in the background just in case that there is a oh, cutscene at the end. Now, what a good lesson, too. I mean, you have these two wonderful friends from the same world who want to try something different and are accepted, and they're so freaking close. Like, I, I love their friends. relationship, like how true of friends they were, and even... Alberto getting jealous, you know, like that makes sense because a lot of people do that like when you're best friends with someone and Then you have a third wheel coming in and I love Julia But honestly like that's the mindset like you have a third wheel coming mm -hmm. in and two people start clicking more than the original two and yeah. People get jealous and they really cared for each other and they still do but I'm just so happy how everything worked out yeah, doing, and yeah. to see the challenges made it so real because kids go through that I mean adults go through it, too. But yes, it's a real kids. life story and Julia loved both boys I mean she loved take you know hanging out with both of them. Yeah, and she, was and she didn't She's favoritize great one over the other but Alberto took it as that yeah and they clicked a little bit more but it didn't yeah. mean that they didn't really enjoy Alberto's company enjoy, yeah. or right. thought that he was yes. different but sometimes two people click a little bit more but it doesn't mm -hmm. mean that I mean sometimes you can't feel like the third wheel though no matter how much That's you try right. to see it like that but yeah. yeah like she really did love him too I just think it was really great I just love how it all just worked out character. in the end and he understood and really liked yeah. Julia as well Julia and her was papa awesome took him in and oh my god her papa like he <laughs> oh, like I so loved sweet. him oh, so tough and scary like. like that perfect specimen of what Luca and family like <laughs> were brought up to fear and they were like even excited talking about him like wow we're in the human world and look at we're like we're this huge dad what do they call him human dad guy that <laughs> is a sea monster killer and they're like whoa and they were scared but just to be around something and feel brave which is crazy and he truly connected with them like he, oh, he is a great dad and he loves his daughter and really took them in to take care of them as well yeah, oh, he was a big, so. you know, a big teddy bear of sorts, and he loved to cook, and he Mama loved pasta. to train Alberto. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, that was so good. They learned a lot, and it was so fun seeing them in their ocean life going on land and how different things were. Like, even walking, like, they've never, well, Luca never tried that before, so that was hard for That's him right. to learn. And then eating with a fork, like, that was weird. And seeing the stars in the sky and calling them fish. Yeah. <laughs> yes. And Julia's character is wonderful because even with these weird things that they would say, she never judged them. Like, she understood mm -hmm. they were different and had a different upbringing. She's so missed, sweet. Like, not the right knowledge, you know, but she didn't, like, judge them for it and be like, what's wrong with you? Like, are you stupid? Like, she never did that. And she was so no. positive and, like, she just brought in a good direction and she's like she okay well, let me she show wanted you to teach yes. yeah she loved to teach yeah and that really yeah, helps that motivate good. kids too and make them feel more confident where just because you think different doesn't mean something's wrong with you so that was also a good lesson to feel like if you have questions ask them you know your Absolutely. friends should be your friends and not judge you and make you feel bad for not knowing something so yeah. I think that was sweet just heartwarming um, just yeah. jumping around but even at the end too with um, everyone accepting that they were scared to see monsters because that's all humans have known too like sea monsters right. are scary and sea right. monsters are scared of humans because they kill all kinds of fish and sea monsters mm -hmm. of course not many because it's legend now or something but maybe back when and that's how all the scary stories started and then there's some sightings here and there but even having residents already there that were sea monsters that's right 
and they right, were living incognito. there for a long time, probably. And probably grandma's friends, or maybe not, but grandma goes there on the weekend, <laughs> so they might be friends of hers or something. <laughs> And so everyone great. accepting it like that was just great and even the parents like actually hanging out with julia's family and having dinner there grandma too like that was wonderful mm -hmm. and also throwing water on the kids that the kids that was, oh yeah how kids ironic was that you know <laughs> mom and dad they they hang out on the you know in the city and they're looking for their son and in the meantime they're having so much fun That's trying right. to do these little tricks on these little kids that's I know, right. trying to find their own, and I was just like, oh my god, because I don't know like how authority works there, but you would think that the cops would come out and arrest them, because I'm yeah, sure right? you can be tough on the streets, but when you're harassing all the kids in the neighborhood or in the city, it's like... The kids are scared of you. Yeah, and like, you have a reputation that people know who you are, and they're just scared, and I'm like, wouldn't they get in trouble or arrested? But, you know, that's like another story, so um, it was funny. Yes, and um, it was. even though they know their kids, like right away, I keep saying kids as in Alberto too, I know he's not their kid, but when Luca, you know, rode his bike by, they knew right away that that was him. But before yeah. that, they never saw his human form before. So, mm -hmm. you know, to even That's think right. that way, like crap, you're going into a scary world, not even knowing what your kids look like, you know, yes, I think that was, yes. uh, that was a Luke, huge risk. Yeah. And Luca's mother too, but she knew how to kick ball. She was a natural. It's almost like she's done it before. So she I thought, I thought that was going to go somewhere too. She's on mission to find Luca, but I really thought over time she might see him now and again and realize he's okay and actually like playing ball. And then I thought that was going to initiate like, oh wow, well this is kind of fun and different, and I'm actually really good at this. So and I thought she'd actually try to start playing ball professionally or something. <laughs> or that would also stay lead on off the, on the land more. Yeah, sure. like she'd want to stay on the land to do that. Like, oh yeah. wow, well human life isn't that That's bad. Cool. There's a lot of cool sports that I actually love doing. So I thought that might expand and do something there with the mom mm -hmm. wanting to stay as well. But then it would make the story a lot longer and kind of veer off. So it was good that it didn't go that way, but that's what I thought. The focus on Luca, like that was just perfect. I just enjoyed everything about it. It was emotional at the end too. It like was. Even it was Alberto emotional. and him hugging, you know, like that oh, was that good to show true. that friends can go in different directions and it's okay. Right. You and guys will see each other the Vespa. again. He sold their dream, their initial dream, so he can actually have his friend do his true dream of going to school. I mean, that's that was a beautiful story. So true friendship. Yeah. Like that was just amazing. Like what a lesson right. there. I mean, no selfishness at all. That like, he nope. was so selfless to do that. I mean, to have a dream, that is wonderful. And then you want to go through it. Maybe they will one day. But once you start learning more about what that's about, because it might be something brand new. Like them, it was completely new, going into a completely different world on land, driving something for the first time. Like you don't drive anything <laughs> underwater. And thinking, like, we can go anywhere, but you know nothing about the land world. So... You know, you don't know how good or bad it's going to be. So going on land and realizing like, oh, there's all these other opportunities. And for Luca at school, I want to know more about this. I want to have more knowledge to know what we're getting ourselves into. I don't even know if he's going to want the Vespa after that. Like, oh, he wants school now. He doesn't really care so much about the Vespa. But right. you know what I mean? Like you learn <laughs> along the way and your dreams can change and it's okay. Absolutely. Right. You can start in one direction and leave with another. Yeah. Right. It could definitely branch right. off. And, yeah. um, and I can see them like staying great friends and him like maybe they'll take an adventure in a Vespa but it won't be like a permanent thing where they go forever just constantly across country all the time I think they could just do trips here and there and yeah and maybe um you know Alberto will help Julia's father you know go do fishing or do something else you yeah, know with his what he good. loves yes. to do which is ironic because he's a sea monster but mm -hmm. i mean yeah. you know do something you else learn. branch off to do his own thing or go back or go to school yeah. himself next year yeah and alberto knows a lot about fish i mean it's always great to have a good education and alberto is so comfortable being there right now like he wants to travel but he likes that family so i think he could really help the father with his fishing company at least yeah, or like good, really just definitely. gather fish instead of hunting monsters because he wasn't right. really yes. making money off that anyways because it was all rumors and hearsay and you didn't really hear <laughs> much right. about it. So it's not like he had a sea monster mounted in his house or something. Even though he has a reputation, I guess, for hunting them, that's not yeah. his career to actually make that's money. That's right, Alberto so, yeah. knows where all the fish are, so... Mm -hmm. They, they so flourish when he oh, found <laughs> out. Oh, his <laughs> uncle! <laughs> okay, so we'll watch this. We can't sure. hear him yet. <laughs> <Wait>. <laughs> his eyes.
Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you straight away. <laughs> See? Bye bye. Oh, your I'll go back. I'll go back. I'm I promise. Back. Oh, that was good. The uncle was the creepiest. I mean, he was so funny. His design was great. What are those evil looking ones? The angular fish or something? The evil looking oh, ones? I remember yeah. like Finding Nemo where it has a sharp yes. teeth and it's like translucent. <laughs> and yeah. like that was pretty scary to see. I mean, just thinking like as a kid, that must be scary to see like all the organs and your uncle and his heart stops and you got to oh, punch it. Right. Like <laughs> never seen that before. That was very original. Was really <laughs> so I'm glad the father wasn't like that. You know, to actually yeah. stay with your uncle for the whole season, especially right, in the deep. Right, just to keep him yeah. safe is like, really? Do you? really want to bring your kid with him i know I, <laughs> he seems a little off you know i don't know what he's gonna do or if he's gonna really watch him because luca's probably gonna stray anyways i don't know yeah he's he, gonna yeah. work out i don't think i thought there was gonna be a twist to where alberto was going to find out that julia's father killed him in some way and that's why he was separated from his father and he was so lonely mm -hmm. i thought there would be his, something dark like that yeah, too. i thought okay, it was gonna yeah. be sad that his father was taken you know yeah but he left he let he left him alone and that was it and i mean like that's, that's terrible lonely. enough to do that i thought there was going to be more too where his parents mm -hmm. or at least one of them was killed by a human but I was debating it throughout the movie because I'm like, well, Alberto's all positive about going to this village and checking it out, and he didn't seem scared, and he's been living on the surface for a while. So I'm like, well, that wouldn't make sense unless he's just in denial if his father was murdered mm -hmm. by a land person to like be like, oh, cool, positive, let's check this out and explore this. So they kept or it. He was just so happy, yeah, that he had a friend that he can, you know, be a role model to. Yeah, he was so alone for so long mm -hmm. and just in hopes that maybe he would come back. And yeah, so that was sad. And I'm just happy that, you know, Alberto found Luca. The idea of the magic was fun. I'm calling it magic where right when they were above the water, they would just turn into humans. And yes, then right away, the water yeah. would turn them back into sea creatures. Like, that was kind of fun to see. Yeah. And I think that's a fun power yeah, to have, you know, you get to live <laughs> underwater and on land. Breathe air, breathe water, and it's just pretty cool. Yeah. All the lands you can go worlds. to. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Opens up a lot more space because land gets pretty crowded and to have a lot of homes underwater. I mean, there's a huge ocean, a lot of oceans, a lot of water yeah. that oh, takes yeah. over sure, most exactly. of the earth. So that's kind of neat to actually explore and stuff. So yeah. the animation was wonderful, um, beautifully done, very smooth. Love the designs yeah, of the I characters, think. adorable. Like, I loved Luca, just how pleasant kind respectful he was and julia she was really good she was great she was great oh, with them. she was a she super was girl and she loved to teach and she was so excited was when so luca excited. was excited yeah. about learning about the universe and yeah that scene was fun mm -hmm. and yeah. she defends people like mm -hmm. it sucks having bullies and again i was lucky growing no. up because i never had bullies ever i mean i think <laughs> one time in high school which it just happened i just was in the wrong spot the wrong time and um it was like the first week of school and i was a freshman and i remember there was a fight upstairs and one guy um, accidentally hit into me and like really slammed me into a locker and kind of dazed me for a second and another guy came over who knew me and he's like don't you effing like touch her again and i was like what just happened and like that's the only experience i ever had but like people get bullied and um, it's just terrible. Mm -hmm. It's just absolutely shame. just yeah. terrible. You know, like that was awesome doing. seeing this girl stand up to other people and be like, you know, screw you. Like don't right. do that to because other people. Because she's the underdog. She usually stays with her mom during school and yeah. she stays with dad in the summer and she wanted just to fit in. Yeah. Yeah, she so that was good. Did. And I couldn't stand the bad guy. Was his name Enrico or something? And, yeah. You know, just all about himself. He was and such a jerk. And I'm so glad his. He uh, needed someone like that. <laughs> just pompous. And <laughs> Chicho and Guido really got to him at the end. I'm glad they turned on him. I was kind of yeah, hoping for that. Like but time. I was like, there's such suck ups that it would take a lot for them to turn around and be like, screw you. But yeah. I'm glad that worked out. It did. For yes. sure. I thought he was yeah. going to have something more coming to him. Like, but then we don't want to promote revenge or anything either. No. So that's Too never many. a good thing. I just wanted to, that. Just to lose <laughs> was great. Not good. Yeah. <laughs> so just to lose and have the people against him. Like, I mean, there's sea monsters, but I'm taking it deeper where I'm like, there's still 
smart. They are very much mm -hmm. human. They're a lot. I mean, they turn into humans right. no matter what. Like yeah, you see it, their anatomy is human when they're on land. They're talking mm -hmm. on the same level as you. Even just talking, like they're people. And for you to have a harpoon <laughs> and just go after, like you're gonna kill these people. Like that's insane. Yeah. So just to even do that, like I was like, yeah, away. they're doing a competition. They're they're intelligent to know what's going on and what the competition is for. So I mean, right. that, they're riding bikes and they're communicating they're with everyone. And yeah. if you see yeah. a scary sea monster in the water, like it sucks to be scared and be like, oh my God, and judge it for what it is. Cause you think that they're mindless, just beast or something. And even so, like if you never saw a lion before, ah, kill it, it's scary. Yeah. And they are dangerous, but you know what I mean? Like you see something dangerous, you don't understand it. You just want to oh, yeah. destroy it. it sucks. But now I mean, you have like, on top of that, something that's super intelligent, you can communicate with it, their kids, like, and just people in general. Yeah. It's like, and you still are chasing them with a harpoon ready to kill them. <laughs> it's like, yeah, and we know up. where they came from. I mean, they're, they're in the water, they're in the sea, and they're taught, like Luca was taught by his mom, to mm -hmm. stay away from the boat, stay away, you know, go in the cave, did you, did you hide away? And they're okay. petrified. And for him to be brave enough, him and Alberto, to come to the surface oh, no. and oh, meet God. meet the people and do this. And it's amazing that what they accomplished. Of course they deserve sure. to win. Yeah. So it shows in a good way that you should never be afraid of something new. Not that you That's want to like jump first without thinking and do something dangerous, but mm -hmm. you should feel confident enough to try something different and kind of get a feel if you like it or not, you know, because otherwise you don't want to be stuck doing the same thing. I mean, maybe you'll love That's what it. generations of what your family did in mm -hmm. the past, but you might want to try something different. So that was don't a be nice afraid to message explore. as well. Yeah, don't yeah, be afraid right. to explore, to learn new things. Definitely. And it's a big, beautiful world as you know, I love that quote. That's and right. it's good to right. get out there and really um, get to know things for yourself instead of what other people tell Definitely. you, you know, I mean, mm -hmm. teachers tell yeah. yourself too. You know what I mean? Like not just That's your family. Right. Yeah. So very good. Loved it. Guys, thank yes. you for requesting this. Please let us know what you thought of this movie. We love grandma. Grandma was awesome. awesome. Yes. And I love the worlds underwater where it was like farming and you had the fish like sheep and they even bad. Yes. Like that was fun. Yes. <laughs> yeah, so great. Very creative yes. movie. Loved it. And it seemed very original too. Yeah. Very yes. original idea. So thank you guys so much yeah. for watching. Please check out our links below if you want to see our full reactions. And we'll see you very soon as always. Bye guys. Bye. Bye. Silencio Bruno. Uh, estupido. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it was so bad. <laughs>